All right, welcome back, everybody. We are here with another number six to be exact box opening for Ecoria Lair of the Hemeths. So, uh, yeah, this is the last of that first case. Um, I don't know if I'm going to open another case yet or not, or I mean, because I still got, um, some fat packs I can do. I still got some, um, uh, uh, whatchamacallit, some, um, uh, I bought the, uh, pre-release kits. And with that, box number six, guys. The last of the, uh, first, uh, case. Like I said, I got so many other things to open. I don't know if I am going to do any more. Box stopper. Goes off to the side. So, first two uh, boxes were astounding. Third box was good. Last two were eh. Like I said, on a scale of zero to five. Five being the best. First two were fives. The uh, third one was a three. The last two I would have to say are were probably two two point fives. So mediocre at best, and that's still skewed. Uh, I like things nice and even. Slowly, there we go. Yep. And still a little bit skewed. And that's good. Alright. First pack. Box six. Top left row. You know how I like to order them. Alright. We have the cat bird. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. I don't know what kind of what what's what what does the fox say? All right, we got the catbird. We have a blossoming sands as our land, and our rare is Yadaro, wandering monster. Yay for Yadaro! Um, uncommons, barrier breach, mystic subdual, and heartless act. Um, common wise, nothing spectacular that's standing out. All right, pack number two. What row ready? Where are we going? Which 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 way do we go, ready? Ecoria. Hey, it's our favorite dude. It's the grunt human soldier. Rawr, rawr. Quit making fun of me. I'll poke you. Um, as for our land for the pack, it's a mountain. And our rare is... Yes, a Zagoth Triome. I will take a box full of Triomes all day long. On commons are Bastion of Remembrance, Wingspan Mentor, and Jubilant Skybonder. Awesome sauce, guys. All right. As far as commons go... Doesn't look like anything interesting appears. On to the third pack. Our no table required. Standard issue. Jungle Hollow is our land for the pack. And our rare is a mountain. God, I needed a mountain. No, it's a foil mountain, guys. It's it's all good. From Diego to the Bay. All right, our rare actually is Crystalline Giant. I'm trying to think rares. Yeah, we can do it that way. Crystalline Giant. All right, uncommons. Weaponize the monsters. Blitz of the Thunder Raptor. And alert heat bonder. 
And as for the commons, let's see if anything stands out. Oh, I see our first alternate art of the box cloud piercer. I don't know what I'm saving that spot for. I guess we'll find out. All right, we got a human soldier, you guys. Not our, our best friend down, like down below, but we got another human soldier. Our land for the pack is a swamp and our rare. The Vivian Monsters Advocate Alternate Art. Horikawa Bunga. Very nice, very nice. We will take her in all her glory and shapes and forms. Actually, she goes down with the alternate arts. All right, um, nice, mythic alternate art. Uh, Avian Oddity, Flourishing Fox. And Frillskill Mentor are our uncommons. And it doesn't look like anything else of note. So how is everybody dealing with the, the uh, advent of being, going back to normal? I mean, it's not normal, it'll never be normal again. We have to face that, but stuff reopening, you know, getting out and about, playing magic with your friends, yes. All right, and focus, there we go, yes, we got our token card. I'll put token way over, way, way over. Um, our land for the pack is an island. Our rare is, yes, Luminous Bro Brood Moth, AKA Mothra. So I will take that. I, I did not realize it was a mythic too, but I understand why. It is a very good card. Um, Monster Step, Survey Crystal, and a Sprite Dragon as our uncommons. And among the commons, there is nothing of note. All right. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Hey, there's our companion guy. Our companion placeholder, we'll put him right there. Windscarred Crag is our land for the pack and our rare is... Karuga the Macro Sage. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Swallow it whole, swallow it whole, that poor guy. He wanted to be swallowed whole, but not in that way. Auspicious Starix, and ooh, an alternate art Necro Panther. Very nice. As for the commons, it looks like we're stuck with greater sandworms and convolutes, nothing else. All right, on to the next, guys. So, along with that, what do you guys think of Aquaria overall? Since now this is like box number six, I still got some, and a fat pack that we did, and I'm going to do some pre-release kits. Human Soldier, and we also did the uh, um, uh, Collector's Edition. Bloodfell Caves. For our land and our rare is Kogla. King Kong ain't got nothing on me. Come on, focus, focus on Kogla. There we go, Mr. Kogla. All right, uncommons, we got Adatha Crystal, Reconnaissance Mission, and Mr. Clash of Titans. Evolving Wilds, guys, buy them up now. Most broken card in Magic. All right, along with the, home, the Evolving Wilds, it looks like we got nothing else. Nothing, nothing, nothing else. All right, we got the no table required. We have a rugged highlands as our land. And as our rare, we have a corpse churn foil. So our actual rare is Lutri. 
I think that's my playset, guys. I'm, I'm, I'm happy for that. Lutri. Um, uncommon wise, we got Reptilian Reflection, Glowstone Recluse, and an alternate art, Parcel Beast. Common wise, it looks like the Almighty Brushwag is going to take out the Blister Spit Gremlin, but the Migratory Great Horn is going to have a cathartic reunion with the Serrated Scorpion. Wow, I wonder if you could, you could make a storyline out of that. Like, if as long as you had like a like a creature, or I should say, a summon spell. That's right. They used to be called summon spells. Um, token card guys, and then had like uh, instant or sorcery. Let's try that once. All right, Thornwood Falls is our land for the pack, and our rare is Eerie Ultimatum. I don't want no more ultimatums. Um, so you neutralize the easy prey with the Hump Master Liger for our uncommons. But the Whisper Squad um, humbly naturalized the Evolving Wilds with a Helica Glider. Um, the Facet Reader, Frostveil ambushed the Perimeter Sergeant, but he Fire Prophesied the Dreamtail Heron uh, with the Lurking Dead Eye. I don't know, guys. Uh, alternate art, Dreamtail Heron. Trying something a little bit different now. Be cool, kind of like. Um, that might be a little game. You play with your friends and stuff. You know, when you're sorting through old cards, is just make up stories um, as you go through the cards. Uh, dinosaur token. Yes. Forest is our land for the pack. And our rare is... Shark Typhoon, a.k.a. Sharknado. Sharknado, where are you? Will of the All Hunter. Cunning Nightbonder and Splendormare are our uncommons. And among the commons, there is Nada. Nada. The fully grown. Uh, uh, no, I won't do it without. It's too late. I already put them down. Human Soldier token. Shocker, right, guys? Our land is a Scoured Barrens. And our rare is a Foil Weaponize the Monsters. But our actual rare is Cub Warden. Cubby, 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 Cub, Cub Warden. All right. Uh, Sanctuary Smasher, Zagoth Crystal, and Sonorius Hallbounder are our uncommons. And among the commons... The Patagia Tiger wins out. Alright, this is the last of the first row of cards, so 12 packs in. And nothing really astounding. I mean, the alternate art Vivian was Ken Q. But, I mean, yeah, nothing like that really stood out. I haven't got a foil rare yet, I've got a mountain. Ooh. All right, anyways, our human soldier friend protecting the rest of the pack. Uh, a forest is our land for the pack, and our rare is Slitherwisp. Awesome. Slitherwisp is going places, guys. Fight as one. A porky parrot alternate art. Or, yeah, yeah, porky parrot. I, I said it right that time. I got it right. Um, and a trumpeting gnar as our last uncommon. Among the commons, we find nothing, nothing, nothing onto pack 13, row 2. Our token card, our obligatory land for the pack, planes, and our rare is. A full art of Requill Phoenix. I think that actually gives me a playset of the full art if I include the foil one. All right. Uh, Exuberant Wolf Bear, Escape Protocol, and Sprite Dragon are our uncommons. Among the commons, 
it does not look like we got anything in particular. Ah, slippery when wet, guys. Slippery when wet. Look in the hole. Hello, hello. I am a pack of magic cards. I will make you spend all your money. All right, we got the no table required. We have got the Tranquil Cove. And we have got a foil capture sphere. So yeah, they're, they're um, bond kind of like uh, our friendship kind of got busted up. Our rare is a Bonders Enclave. Our uncommons are Charge of the Forever Beast, Rudin Moloch, and Regal Leosaur. Common wise, nothing, nothing. Yeah, I mean, those first two boxes, I was like, hey, this is going to be a hot case. And then it was like, eh, eh, just kept getting worse and worse. Oh, well. All right, a dinosaur. Whee! A swamp for our land for the pack. And then our rare is... Never mind. It is a foil cavern whisperer alternate art. Pretty badass. Our actual rare is a triome, which I will take. A rogrin, rogrin triome. All day, every day on the triomes, guys. Ivy elemental, proud wild bonder, and a general's enforcer for our uncommons. For the commons, we got Broco evolving wilds. I'm telling you guys. Don't ever, 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 ever us underestimate the Evolving Wilds. Uh, thwart the enemies. Glimmer Bells pacifies the Drown Stinger, but it's a mutual destruction. All right. Hey, Human Soldier. Not our favorite Human Soldier. Not our buddy, 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 but his, his brother-in-law. All right, our land is a Rugged Highlands, and our rare is a Keenan. Okay, Bonder Prodigy. All right, Keen Sight Mentor, Horn Bash Mentor, and a Pouncing Shore Shark are our uncommons. Unexpected Fangs ram through got fully grown the crustacean but the perimeter sergeant capture sphere the migratory great horn alternate art by the way who had a forbidden friendship with the lurking dead eye that vulcapeded i don't know <laughs> vulcapete it could it could be a verb leave me alone it could be vulcapete it sounds like it could be a verb Rip it open. All right. Hey, it's our buddy. He's back. He got he got jealous of the brother-in-law, so he decided to come back and make his his play as our number one human soldier. Our land is a Bloodfell Caves, and our rare is it's not a well it is a rare, but it is a foil Mythos of Aluna. So it is a foil rare. That's our first foil rare. Yes. The Mythos of the Lunafoil. Our actual rare is a Yorion, the Sky Nomad. A Duskfang Mentor, Savai Thundermane, and an alternate art, Insatiable Hemophage, are our uncommons for the pack. It's licking, it's licking that little old guy. It's going blah, 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 blah. That is a lick, guys. His tongue is not inserted into any cavity. Do not be fooled. All right. Uncommons, or I mean commons. Nothing of note. The forbidden friendship, I tell you. It's a hoot. It's a hoot. Who's to say it's forbidden? Who makes these rules? Just because a man can love another man, 
It's okay for Tom Green to hump a dead moose. <laughs> oh, random song lyrics come to mind. All right, we got a human soldier. That's his sister, by the way. So sister, brother-in-law, and him. They rule the soldier pack. Dismal backwater is our land, and our rare is a hunted nightmare. Uncommon wise, we got Boon of the Wish Giver. Oh, I gotta, I gotta find the sweet spot. See, because it's trying to focus on the back, and it's trying to Boon of the Wish Giver, Storm Wild Caprador, and a Boneyard Lurker. Among the commons, uh, it doesn't look like there is anything special. There is not. They will go make their own story in my common pile. Whee. All right, we got a cat. The cat, the cat, the cat is back. That's their pet. Uh, a plains for our land for the pack, and for our rare, we have got not a migration path. Felt like there was something sticking underneath there. A Gyruda, Doom of the Depths. But we do have a Migration Path and a Ketria Crystal and Skull Prophet for our uncommons for the pack. As far as the commons go, nothing special. All right, so guys, as we're getting halfway through, I'd like to remind you to please like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave comments below on what you like, what you don't like, anything that's cool anything that you'd like to see um i'd like i'm doing box openings galore um doing some videos tonight i'm probably going to broadcast some fortnite as i'm playing um a cat token cat token all right an island has our land and our rare is probably going to be a foil because i can't quite get it nope it's song of creation the song of creation all right, uncommon wise, alien oddity, sanctum lockdown, and the grim dancer. Our commons are going to be a greater sandworm, the sleeper dart, and the fire prophecy blitz leech, which took away on the dream tail hair on. Make up your own stories, folks. I'm not a storyteller. Well, actually, I am. That's what I did for many, many years. I told stories about how great a place it was to work. <laughs> Human Soldier. Um, Swift Water Cliffs is actually, I don't know. The art's okay, I guess. Yeah. yeah. You get the blue. We have a foil, Scoured Barons, as our foil second non basic land. And a Ferocious Great Shark as our actual rare. Among the Uncommons, Polywog Symbiote, ooh, a Majestic Oricorn, alternate art, and a Back for More. All right, and among the Commons, we have got a whole bunch of junk. Well, I, sh I shouldn't say that junk. Just this point, box number six, a fat pack, and, or if I should say bundle. They don't, they don't want to upset anybody. Which, by the way, okay, guys. So, um, I don't know if you read, and I don't know how big of fans you are of D&D. D&D was my uh, initial segue into um, any type of fantasy, including Magic the Gathering. In fact, it was through my D&D group at college that I got into Magic. Um, but, Mountain is our land focus so we can get a good focus there we go on our rare everquill phoenix um so yeah i actually started playing magic through our D, D group at college and unbreakable bond zagoth crystal channeled force are in commons and they're going through now and wizards has made a statement that they're changing uh the name or description or something of classic things like drow and orcs because of the whole um, Black Lives Matter thing that's going on. Oh, don't get me wrong. I believe 
in social equality. But when you start targeting groups of people based on the actions of one individual, you yourself are doing the prejudice, the hate crimes. So uh, hold the person accountable, the individual. Yes, do not hold an entire group of individuals, an entire force. Um, that'd be like saying all Republicans suck. All Republicans don't suck. There are some that do suck, but not all. So you're, you're, you're creating that barrier, that racial inequity, by making statements like that. Beast token. And I know I don't want to get all political and everything on, on here because we're having fun. We're, we're watching the blossoming sands turn into our rare of Mythos of Brokos. Um, but swallow whole that pride of yours. Swallow whole that pride. Um, Ominous Seas and Archipelagor are the uncons. Uh, and, and realize that not just black lives matter, but all lives matter. And a lot of people will be like, well, not all lives can't matter until black lives matter. No, by stating that black, li black lives matter, you have just created a racial boundary. You have said that one group is more important than the other. You need to say all lives matter. And nothing among the commons. I mean, that's my little philosophy. That's the, the, the deepest I'll get into um, stating some political views or stuff about social injustice. Because um, I don't I don't want that to be on this channel. But I thought it had to be said. Um, because when I read that article about D&D changing the names due to the uh, ongoing issues in society i was like you got to be kidding me that just ticked me off guys human soldier it's like okay i am going to make one more common <laughs> dismal backwater is our common our land for the pack followed by a foil heartless act and our rare is another mythos oh my god it is a mythos box so i had three non-mythos slash uh Ultimatum boxes. Now I'm into my Mythos Ultimatum boxes. All right, Valiant Rescuer, Lord Dracus, Alternate Heart, and a Clash of Titans are our three uncommons. Um, but like, so the tearing down of like Civil War statues and stuff like that. Oh, a Cavern Whisperer. Um, you know, when we forget our history, we're doomed to repeat it. Um, and and that is part of our identity people it's part of who we are as as a nation because if the south had won do you think things would be like they are today no no by no means if if hitler had won world war ii do you think we would be where we are today no we wouldn't so when you start you know wanting to erase the history that we've had you're forgetting who we are and how we got there. Thornwood Falls is our land for the pack. And a love brink venturer, venturer, followed by weaponize the monsters, reconnaissance mission, and jubilant skybonder. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that there when you when you start tearing down monuments and statues and saying that they represent something that they really don't represent. They represent a part of our history. It's all they represent, people. Hell, you might as well go tear down the Statue of Liberty then because we do not accept people with open arms anymore. Give me your poor, your whatever. Trump doesn't want that. Um, so why, why do we com continually want to get rid of the past is my question. Mystic Subduel foil. That actually looks pretty cool. The eyes are all glowy, and our rare is a Death's Oasis. Um, uncommons are Zagath Mamba, Momentum Rumbler, and Footfall Crater. Followed by the commons that don't look like they hold anything in particular. Um, anyways, that's my two cents on that, guys. That's all, that, that's all I want to talk about. It's, 
It's my opinion. You can yell at me. You can shout at me in the comments. You can do whatever you want. It's my opinion. My video. So either you agree or disagree. I don't. I don't care if you do or don't. You know, you, that's part of the great thing is that you guys can have your own opinion. Um, human soldiers are token. Sis is getting upset. Um, planes for our land and our rare is a whirlwind of thought. Uncommon's will of the all hunter dire tactics and chittering harvester. Among the commons, it does not look like there is anything. All right, guys. Wow, we are down to two, four, six, eight, nine packs out of our case. Nine packs. And at this point, I'd like you to once again, please like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and leave comments below. It's all in good nature. It is all fun because we all enjoy one thing in common and Magic the Gathering. And I find that with most type of social games, whether it be D&D, whether it be Magic the Gathering, whether it be some Monopoly, is that gaming and that type of uh, atmosphere brings us together. It doesn't matter race, it doesn't matter religion, it doesn't matter color, creed, nationality. Guess what? I'm going Pasco and I'm going to collect my $200. All right, Jungle Hollow. Yeah, see, it's focusing on the back cards. I got to get it like right there. We're still working on it, guys. We're working out the kinks, and we got an ultimatum. I'm not even going to say inspired ultimatum because it's not inspired. It's an ultimatum that should not exist. Save Crystal, Titanith Rex, and Zenith Flare. Uh, among the commons, there is nothing. There is nothing. All right. Eight packs left. Oh. All right, we have a dinosaur token. No human soldier, but we needed his companion, his uh, forbidden love character. Scoured Barrens is our land for the pack, guys. And our rare is an unpredictable cyclone. Um, Call of the Death Dweller, Auspicious Starix, and Primal Empathy are our uncommons. Among the commons, nothing of note. So I mean, you can you can go ahead and leave your comments below on on you know the statements I've made. I'm fine with that as long as they don't uh, aren't derogatory as far as cursing, swearing, picking on any other race or culture or creed. You know, I'm I'm going to take any type of comment to heart. I'm open-minded as such. Um, our mountain is our land with an adventurous impulse foil underneath, and our rare is Brokos, Apex of Forever. I, I so much love the alternate art version. Much better, much, much better. Um, Uncommons, Ragrin, Crystal, Void Beckner, Flame Spill. Ram through the Frost Lynx, who Volcapeded into the Lurking Dead Eye. With the rumbling roar. Uh, but, I mean, regardless of what I say or do, I want you guys to enjoy the video. I want you guys to have fun. I want you guys to give me your feedback. So subscribe, like the video, and comment below. Follow me on all my various platforms, uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and, uh, of course, uh, my favorite, UpLive which after I finish this video, we're probably going to go do some uh, Windscarred Crag as our land, and our rare is a ruinous ultimatum. Oh my gosh. I'm done with the mythos and, and ultimatums. All right, Lead the Stampede is our first uncommon Necropanther and Frillskill Mentor. And among the commons, it doesn't look like anything in particular, but, um. Yeah, follow me on Uplife as Wildman X. Uh, I am an assistant to an agency on there, so that's a lot of fun. We, we are the Madhouse Agency. We have a blast, um, whether it be playing trivia games about music or 
um, just entertaining ourselves. <laughs> and uh, like tonight is Fortnite All Night and Queenie's Broadcast. So uh, Scoured Barrens is our basic land and our rare is a Real, uh, the Everwise. Commons are Easy Prey, Barrier Breach, and Heartless Act. I see a Cloud Piercer here. Might as well just skip right to that. I doubt they're going to have more than one alternate art in a pack. Um, but yeah, we just like to have fun. We like to hang out. We like to listen to music, play games, just talk to each other. We have people from all over the world in our agency. We have people from Canada, from... Um, England from Germany so lots of fun human soldier guys human soldier number 2668 uh, forest as our basic land and our rare is Loris the broken all right uncommons bastion of remembrance generals enforcer and hey Hunt master liger alternate art um, commons, like I said, doubt there's one since there's already one alternate art. Probably not. Last three packs, folks. Last three packs. Hope you've enjoyed the video thus far. I've tried to be entertaining, tried to be philosophical, tried to share a little knowledge and love with y'all. So please like the video. Human soldier. Like she does. She likes the video. She may look angry, but she likes the video. Swamp is our land for the pack, and our rare is. It had to happen sometime, right? It's a rare. It's a foil. It's an ultimatum. All right. Uh, our actual rare. Oh, I'll take that, though. An alternate art triome. So this, this last pack, I guess, is a little bit better because of that. Uh, Wingspan Mentor, Monster Step, and Parcel Beast are our uncommon. Uh, not last pack. Uh, last box. So it moved up to a two, solid 2.5. I don't think it's going to hit the 3 unless we get something amazing in these last two packs or in the box topper. A dinosaur token. Weehaw! Dinosaur says, yay, I'm hasty. Yay! All right, our land for the pack is a dismal backwater. And our rare is, ah, an Endotha Triome. Get, again, I will take Triomes all freaking day. Uh, and Datha Crystal to go with it. A Trumpeting Nar and a Porky Parrot are uncommons. Among the commons, there is Nada. Last pack, guys. God pack, right? All foil, all alternate art mythics. And they'd be, I don't know. Mythos. I don't know. Uh, that would be my mythos. I don't think are. Uh, I could. I could do with the uh, triumphs though. All right. Dinosaur beast is our token. Swamp is our land, and our rare is the Oozalith. Harsh way to go out, guys. Harsh, harsh, harsh ending of the pack. Flourishing fox, pouncing shore shark, and blitz of the. Thunder, followed by a bunch of comments. All right. So now we have the box topper. Before we reveal, once again, guys, I want to say thank you for watching. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and leave comments below. And our box topper is, please, no baby Godzilla. It is King Caesar, Awoken Titan, a.k.a. Snapdex. So pretty decent one. Not, not going to complain. I do, like, I do like the picture. So awesome, guys. I want to thank you all for joining once again. Please take care of yourselves and each, each other. And you guys all have a wonderful evening. And... Uh, yeah, just take care.